I don't know if I should be doing this. What's up YouTube? Welcome to my channel. My name is Victoria Blends and today in this video I'm going to be doing part two of cleaning and organizing my dresser and drawers and totes of all beauty products. So part one I didn't show my face so hi. <laughs> hi it's me. <laughs> I'm on my bedroom floor. Well, actually, it's my family's house that we've had for a very long time. And this has always been my bedroom. And I kind of moved back. And over the past year and a half, I've collected things for all things beauty. And so, basically... Yeah, sorry. <laughs> basically, this drawer has been with me for many years and so it's always been like a beauty drunk drunk junk drawer and yeah so i'm just gonna be cleaning this out i've already organized new products that i've purchased all 2020 and so they were thrown in that tote but i finally organized it with skincare and makeup and hair care and this is what this drawer is this is makeup this is just like an odd and crazy junk drawer and this bottom one is all hair products it's really kind of just like dirty because it's makeup i don't even really use anymore and so i'm going to be either giving it away putting it in the vault my little makeup vault that i created of makeup that i have that i don't really use and so i created a section for that and then basically the same section that i said so hair care beauty skincare i know there's like something in here and yeah this is just stuff i basically use every day yeah almost every day so i have right now in my hair that's why i have a hat on i washed in the evening and i have this moisture moisture rich leave-in conditioner so this is my hair product but however it's not going to fit in the drawer and this cabinet <laughs> Is filled with stuff you see so basically I have this cleaner I found Windex I already used my Lysol little mixture that I had we already used that all so what I'm gonna do is wrap up my hair it's gotten like really long within these past like four months and so I have my nails my natural nails so Yeah, that's not cool. Anyways, I don't want to, like, show my underarms. I don't know. I think that's, like, really sexy for a girl, but, like, very unflattering as well. Like, when you're just, like, doing things, you know? Anyways. <laughs> I just got this last night because I got rollerblades. And I've been massaging my hands, the tops of my hands, because I've been doing cartwheels and stuff and stretching and yeah it feels so good and tingly i'll link it below but basically you just like put it on the floor or you can even put it on your partner's back and like roll your foot and like roll your partner's back at the same time that's right okay so that's that my favorite face wipes they've been all over the place right now because they're gonna go back to being all over the place because they use them if I need a refreshing, like say today, I'm gonna just take off my mascara with them. Uh, honestly, I don't lie, I'm probably gonna be doing a lot of cleaning and stuff. And I woke up, always wake up at like 5:15, and to be honest, I'll probably sleep with my mascara. Can't lie here, girl. I can't lie. So, but just because I said that, I honestly, I'll probably wash my face just because it's like that's disgusting. Okay, this is the leave-in curl definer cream that I use. Same brand. This is the shower oil that I spoke of. And these are just shampoos and conditioners from the same curl product brand. Can never have enough Q-tips. Um, yeah. <laughs> and this is just like a bunch of mail and art. And so this, I'm going to get rid of. It's just some Nivea lotion. I'm turning and I have like brunch right now. So. 
you know when you eat and you're like out of breath and then you start cleaning or start walking after you ate a lot yeah that's what i'm feeling right now i'm just gonna spray the top of this i'm just gonna spray this so you want to clean underneath like right here do you see that hairspray and some lotion and some little change in his little booty my face. There we go. We turn him around. Okay, this is. I'm gonna be showing you a lot of stuff that I use. I really like this oil. This oil is really good. It's called frankincense oil. It's good. It has like, like a, a smell to it that a lot of people don't care for. So I don't tell a lot of people that I use it that so when i said that i mix an oil essential oil with my what did i mix it with mm, the um the blue one of the oh my goodness i can't believe i forgot the name of it i can't believe i forgot the name of it so anyways if you go back to my part one then I said, oh, I only like the blue one and not the bum bum cream. The cocoa mixed with an essential oil. And yeah, that's the essential oil that I use. This is the turmeric and watermelon seed body butter. It's really good. It is super, super good at nourishing stuff. This is a bamboo full fiber full hairspray. There's only like a little bit left. I don't know if I'll ever get it again. To be honest, I'll probably... It's been more than a year that I had it, so I'm just going to get rid of it. And as well as that heat protectant over here, it's been more than a year. I'm just wiping everything down because, like, there's just dust from the winter and stuff, so I have to just basically undust everything. I don't know, because, well, I don't know, I don't know. Anyways, this is a decent upwash. Um, this, um, I used it in my hotel get ready with me. It was in like 2019. Sorry if you can see like the back of my head and if it's really weird, I'm sorry. I'm just like cleaning and stuff. So I'm going to bring you closer and then I'm just going to dig in the drawer and then we're either going to toss it or keep it in here. But for now, there's just going to be a lot of stuff in this drawer. So let me bring you in. Okay, this is 91% alcohol that I use on like the doors and stuff. I should probably... Get some more paper towels and clean this stuff with alcohol right now. But yesterday I took off nail polish and I didn't like how my nails were in the video, like all plain and stuff. So I put some more to just protect my nails just in case I just keep grabbing like recklessly. And so here is the drawer. I can't push it back because I think there are products behind it. But here is everything in the first drawer. So this is a skincare product that I haven't used. And to be honest, look at it. It's just like a super heavy, like, oh my, it just does a lot of things. I don't want to open it because I don't want it to be ruined. 
But don't worry, I will definitely incorporate this in another video if it's a DIY for any kind of makeup or skincare product. I'll definitely, um, definitely make a video of what this actually is. I just don't want to open it. And I don't know, I don't want to say like if it's a wrong name or something. This palette I used a few times and I'm going to keep it because I really like this pink color in it. Those pinks are really good. It looks different on camera, but this Elizabeth one is like a really, really highlighter pink color. Let me take the lid off this thing over here so I can add it to my eyeshadow box. I'm going to use a paper towel to clean off um, the products that are in here that I want. So this is actually, no, it should have been this tote. It is a Sailor Taylor brush. Blush. Oh my god. Wait, let me see if I could tone down how bright it is. These are eyelashes. Um... in here this is really good actually for my lips so I'm going to wet a paper towel and put it in my skincare because I look for it for after waxing it's just a really, really good miracle ointment. Literally, it's so good. Okay. Oh my gosh. So, now my OCD has got to wipe it again because it fell on the floor after I just cleaned it. I'm going to go on my face bag. So, that's it. Face bag. This is lashes. This is a Dior. Here it is. I was like, why is it? I hate these dust bags get so dusty. This was to cover like acne because it's extreme control like oil or something and I barely touched it that's how you could see the name is still in it so I could just put this in face but low key I don't want to because of this dust bag I don't know I just might put it like this inside the face thing I'm gonna have the dust bag I think I might throw the dust bag away <laughs> And this air spun and naturally neutral. And this air spun and suntan. I'm gonna throw them away. Okay, what is this? There's the e.l.f. lip plumper. It's garbage. This is a blush. Chanel blush. It's my favorite blush. Go in the face. That looks so good. Okay, this is from the dollar store, to be honest. La Bam Balm. It's really cute, right? It's just a aesthetic vibe, to be honest. Get rid of it. I'm going to get rid of these things that are, like, from the beauty store, the dollar store and stuff. This is to my, um, Tweezerman. I, what's my call it? I'm just looking for other stuff that's garbage. This is really good. I like this liner, but it's not good anymore. This is the best lip balm for active people. People who run, people who skate, people who swim, people who surf. Everyone, walkers, dog walkers, everything. You go outside, if you have to walk to school, if you have to walk to work, if you have to use the bus, the train, and you're just in the worst weather, the hottest weather, this 5-star lip protection by Blistex, it has to be this like chrome beige color one. This is the best ever. It smells really good too. Like, mm, 
like strawberries to be honest. Super, super good. This is garbage. I don't know what I'm holding on to it. These I've had for a long time. I'm just going to get rid of them. They were just a mix. And to be honest, I can't find two. I don't know if I want to keep these Laura Mercier sponges that I got from... This one actually looks really, really clean. These, This looks bad. This looks bad. This one I'm going to keep and soak and face wash and all that good stuff. So, actually... I need to cut these because garbage people tweak me out. Okay, so how do I have two of these translucent powders? This one's open already, so I kind of don't trust it. And I got another one, so it's just going to get thrown out. These lashes were like a dollar at the beauty store. I don't like the band and how sticky they are, so I would use them for like my clients. I'm like during October and stuff because they're thick, they're dramatic and it's like you're in like full blown makeup anyway so if you're already uncomfortable then wear in an uncomfortable lash that I have to get rid of so yeah I don't know what to do with these I'm gonna keep them in back in this thing so I love a good individual lash this Mary Jo. This was sent to me twice on an accident. I don't know why. So I got two of them, but I just wiped away alcohol, so now it's wiping off. Um, this black one that I never use of Kylie. What is this called? I don't even know. It's just black Kylie. This Morphe lipstick. I wasn't really a fan of because it didn't like show on me. Let's see. I don't know. It just, like, see how it looks? Yeah, on my skin tone, that does not look good. This Rihanna Fenty Beauty. I never used it. I think I used it on a client one time. Uh, Indian skin tone. Indian ethnicity. So, you know, that would look so good on her skin tone. So... Put it in skincare because we're getting to summer. So I'm gonna get darker. This is just a lip gloss from the beauty store. Smells like pencil shavings now. Um, this was my sister was trying to do some Beetlejuice makeup. Um, I think in like 2018, 2019. For Halloween, and this is just some moss that I got from the craft store. These, I forgot where I got them from. I, went, I got a bunch of crest whitening strips in here. Okay. From Teen Day. These were not good. These razors from Marshalls. I had to clean out the bottom of this drawer. These whitening strips, let's see the date. I don't have a date on them. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm going to make these drawers into or anything. I don't know if I want them to be the same thing that they were. Because as you can see, there wasn't a lot in there and I threw a lot out. So I'm not making use of anything that I have. I was not making use of anything that I have. Now I want to make use of what I have. <laughs> so let me see. Let's throw this out. These are just lipsticks I'm gonna throw out. This is like a cool Frito lipstick that I never used. Garnish, just dark bronze Kylie. I think this makeup forever lipstick, makeup forever stick, MAC lipstick, 
Black Kylie lip liner. Another little mini NARS concealer. This rose lip balm from Beauty and the Beast. I'm tossing it. I don't like this lip liner. This I've had since the beginning of freaking time. I don't even think they make it anymore. Cargo Cosmetics. When you do like a red lipstick, then you're supposed to do this lip liner, the reverse lip liner, first. So um, your lip stick and doesn't bleed at the end of the day. So it just, I don't know, it's really cool. This is a nice color. This is like the oldest MAC eyeshadow. Oh, when you keep MAC products, they give you stuff back. So I have to keep these. I forgot how many. I think it's five. I'm going to wash that. This is a key for hand creams at L'Occitane. This is an eyelash applicator. It can stay in here. This lippy color is too bright. I actually like it. Keep it. Another makeup forever color. These are garbage. Okay, so this is still makeup. I don't know what to do with it. I think it was upside down in my thing like that so I could see the color and when I just popped it out I was just like hey <laughs> it's snob it's like this cute Barbie pink color what are these it's just neutral oh my god look at that color change that is no good let's smash it because that would not be safe on your lips what can we smash this on <clears throat> Shit on the back of this. This doesn't show well. Let's see how this is. It looks like flower. I mean, it doesn't look like a rose. Super pretty. Okay. That was probably like my, literally my first makeup forever lipstick. I like this matte red one. Oh, it smells like old makeup. Yes, I'm talking like this is like old makeup, you guys. Okay. I've gotten rid of so much stuff. I have not even bought new stuff. So, yeah, that's why I kind of like I'm going through these things. Because, yeah. People have asked me so many times for so many years. And so I'm just showing you guys what I have and what I'm keeping, what I like. And just a bunch of Makeup Forever, Tarte, Kylie Lips. I gotta wash this. This is garbage. Okay, so done with this one. I've thrown stuff out. That's what I'm going to keep and whatever with. This is a very much so very junk drawer. So, let's see what we got in here. A lot of stuff that I'm going to be throwing out. So I already off the bat I could see some earrings that I just want to throw out. 
Actually, these little pearl things are cute. I don't know. Well, I probably have it for like. I, don't know. I really don't know. Here is a surprise Happy Meal toy from 1996. I did not even know what this is. And it's literally like my childhood. My whole kitty Pez keychain. This sponge from Victoria's Secret Pink. I don't, what am I even doing with this stuff? I'm just like st stacking. Alright. Oh. Another one that we have to add to the trio is nails. So it's hair, skin, nails, and face care. So there's some cotton balls that I use often. I don't even know what I'm doing with this. This could go in the trash because it was a box to two of these tongue scrapers. They're amazing. Oh my gosh, do I even want to go in this drawer? This is like super... This was, this this white light, this is the one that I was going to use because it's literally like, you put it on and that's it, your Beetlejuice white. You know, it's not too much, it's not too heavy, it literally is like a translucent ghost white. So, I have another section for special effects stuff because here is the white liquid latex that I was going to use for his like nasty peeling skin as well as to stick on the moss. So <laughs> since this is like makeup, let me put this in here. What happened to the moss? What happened to the moss, you guys? I lost it. Oh here it's me. It's on the side over there. Okay, so you literally have to open this one too if you want to have that so this is uh so you don't want this to fall this is a really good brush cleaner this is a huge one i have a mini one for travel and then i just like refill with that this is empty with q-tips i would just refill with that this is another empty q-tips i just like to travel with the oh my gosh i don't even want to open this look how old you guys my invisalign i've had invisalign <laughs> For so long, and then I stopped, and I never, ever, ever see it. I never wore my retainer. Do I really want to show my last name? Here are my designs from, let me see, 2013. Yo, holy crap. Let me see. Oh, these are open. I'm not going to use these. Because they're all like, I don't know. They're just open right now, and I don't know how long it's been here, and there's like dust in there. I'm gonna throw it away. This is a cute mirror that I got from the dollar store. So I'll just put it up there. And this is my super old iPhone 6. These are good. This is like if I'm gonna go skating, rollerblading. And I have to wrap up my ankle because I've just like over skated for like two, three hours. And like my ankle is like really like killing me trying to like carry heavy skates. So I got this color, this color, and like a lime green color. But also these are really good for wrapping your arms if you've had liposuction or if you've had non-invasive plastic surgery so say if you did one of those machines then one of your technicians or you know what medical estheticians would just wrap you up well make sure that you're going to a really reliable medical esthetician okay i don't know where to put these is it a beauty is it a nuts? we're just gonna clean this drawer so basically we're gonna put whatever's in this drawer in this drawer just kidding this is from World Market. This store is so cool. I used to keep jewelry in here, so I'm gonna make sure everything's in here. And here, just fold it and wrap it, and it's like a little pouch. I don't know what to do with it. I'm probably going to put this in like a cell thing because I don't really, um, I never really used it. I just had like costume jewelry in there that I never used. So whatever costume jewelry that I didn't use, like this 
these and this stuff. So this custom jewelry was in there. It's cool. It's all out. So yeah. I don't know. This is a huge necklace. I'll probably give this stuff to my grandma. Oh my gosh, look at this diamond choker, you guys. What the heck? Okay, this is really good gum. It makes your teeth really sparkly. A diamond choker with... Actually, here, let me put this back in this bag. I was like, why is it empty? What the heck happens to all the custom jewelry? This Looks like that. This is a cute armband. I love these magic towels. I don't know what to do with this stuff, you guys. Here's that blue nail polish that I had. Um, I don't know how long this has been in here. It's really full, but I'm going to toss it out. Because I have not opened this drawer in a very, very, very long time. Um, I'm sorry, what the heck? A receipt for Walmart for a bunch of Fortnite stuff for my son. Some old costume jewelry. This is a shower cap from Sophie Tell. It's a really nice hotel. I'm going to... Oh, these are for my Invisalign. So when I got a new tray, I would ask for these. And um, they, I could like, they per fit perfectly like when I would bite down on these. And they would just form into my teeth. So when you get a new Invisalign tray, they're just, like, you got to wear them for a bit until they fit, but they weren't snug tight, and I wanted them snug tight every single time I got a new um, pair. Like, if you went and got your metal braces tightened, um, then I would want it just like that. So I would ask for these because they would help so much to, like, bite down, and then, like, literally your tray would just form into like the best place but I don't need that I don't this highlighter pink color okay this candle lid this modern renaissance palette I don't it doesn't look that bad but I kinda like used it on people I don't think it's kinda dirty I'm gonna get rid of it I'm gonna, I don't know if I want to get rid of it. I put it to the side. This I'm actually gonna get rid of. Like literally gonna get rid of this. It didn't wear too many times. This blush palette. This is really pretty. Reminds me of that Chanel one, but it's really really old, and I'm not gonna keep old makeup. I have to get rid of it. This is the eye glasses repairing case with a magnifying glass. Um, this is some lavender essential oil. Um, for some clippers or bikini clippers, to be honest. Oh, I hope they're not in here. Cause that's embarrassing. <laughs> um, notepad. Some Q-tips. More costume jewelry. This shower gel. Uh, there's going to be a lot of shower gels in another drawer over there. That's probably going to be my last one. Because that's, um, there's just a lot of stuff in there. I think I'm going to sell this bracelet. Um, I don't, I haven't worn contacts in like a long time. Like two years. So that's out the game. This neck and chest firming cream I got in like 2019. So, um... It doesn't say on here. It probably says in the box, but you don't keep the box. I'm going to get rid of this. An old hand sanitizer. Always looking for a needle and thread. And here it is, all discombobulated. And this crap. Another box of gum. This is open and disgusting. And 
some tape. Some cheap bag batteries, probably from the dollar store. What's going on? Nail file, cotton pads, cotton pads. These are not mine, they were a client's. And then she went to go shoot, and then I don't know how. But I've always messaged her. I'm like, hey, I have your box. And then they've been in my, basically my fun drawer that I don't touch. So I put them in here because they're fun and I don't touch nothing in here. <laughs> oh my gosh, tell me you know my contacts all dried up. I wonder if these work. There's definitely some contacts in there. I'm afraid. <laughs> I don't know. It's just weird. Here's some color contacts. Ooh, fun. Ooh. Keep these. You guys, this is just a lot. This is why I never did this. Oh, my favorite L'Occitane Lemon Verbena Body Lotion. Used and it probably does not smell nice anymore. This is really fresh. I don't know what where these go to. I haven't used this thing because I did laser and I don't really need my bikini trim like that anymore. <laughs> so, oh, my son made me this, so I keep it. <laughs> There's just so much stuff. What is this too? I don't even know what this is to. Oh my gosh. I'm like already tired. I don't even want to get to the bottom. This is my zombie mom thing. I don't know what happened to my zombie son. He probably took it and stuck it on something. Sorry. Okay, here's my NASA Lego girl. I don't know what happened to her. But here's her rocket. I'm literally getting so tired and annoyed. I'm just ready to throw everything back in here. <laughs> okay, let me just put this on your knees for the hair. This is garbage. I don't know what this is. That's saying. Let's put this in here. Let's throw this away. Let's power freaking do this. Here's some more of those lashes. <sighs> I forgot her name. <laughs> Here's a brush. What do we do with the brush? We put it on here. Okay. Oh, see, maybe there's some contacts in here. Nope, it's empty. Kind of cool. Kind of like an Indian. Resort Native American vibe. Another toy receipt. Let me see. I found this Walmart receipt. I don't know what this is. A toy. Yep. Toy. Walmart has like really good toy aisles. <laughs> And then they're probably like always like a dollar to three dollars cheaper than like Target or something. But then I just got used to shopping online. Oh, here is my NASA girl. NASA chick rocket plans how to rocket. Rocket, don't stop it. Mm -mm. Okay. okay. I don't even have a nail box. I got everything else situated. I cannot believe I don't have a box for my nails. I gotta get this stuff out of here. It's driving me nuts. Okay. These gotta go in this hotel drawer that I've been collecting. I've lived in a hotel all my life. <laughs> Cleaner. No, this is 
just gonna be some more junk. As soon as I, this is just probably organizing, cause as, and getting rid of old stuff. So as soon as like every single thing is like cleared out and like organized, then I go back and pick and choose what cabinets are gonna be for what. So I think that's how we're getting at. Okay. So save those. Save this tongue. Probably only more gonna have notepad, notepad, sticker, and this string. I think my needles are in this white cabinet over here. So I had to sew my son's blanket. <laughs> Some kind of washing when you overwash the kids' comforters, like those character ones. I think I'm going to give this to my grandma and have her just sit and watch her show and detangle it and give her something to do because I don't want to sit here and detangle it. I'm sorry, I just don't. And she has like a whole vanity, like one of those jewelry vanities. She loves costume jewelry. Okay, we're we almost like, done with this. Loki, I want my Invisalign so <laughs> I literally want Invisalign again. It was so much fun. I felt like really, really, really cool when I had my Invisalign and just sorry, my whole government name is on here. This is just old so it's colored discolored my bad. Okay. What do you want me to do? Alright, so um I haven't wiped this drawer. Why? I don't know. Let me get a paper towel and clean it real quick. Sorry if you're like moving. My ring light is literally dropped all the way to the floor. Sliding around. I gotta do nails. Oh no, that's gonna be... So I was trying to do, um, like, this luxury manicure on myself, and my thumbnail decided that it wasn't going to grow with the rest of these. Oh, it's cute. Costume jewelry ring. And there is a sewing needle. Put all these things away. Actually, I really like this one. You know, I had an engagement ring, like exactly like this, but um, the diamonds were close together. There was more diamonds, and they were bigger. And yeah, it was stolen. So I don't wear a lot of jewelry because, for one, I just lost the diamond earring. I think I was taking off my hoodie and it got stuck in my hoodie. And so, yeah, I don't know if I'll ever, I don't know when I'll buy jewelry. Because when I was little, I used to have like a lot of gold jewelry and someone stole like our family's jewelry. And so like growing up, like in high school and stuff, I just like, liked my nameplate in gold. And I only have that still. Like, I think that's like the only thing I have. And it's in storage, like, tucked away. So, like, away from, like, people walking in and out and stuff. So, where I know it's, like, safe. And so, let's just throw this stuff back in here. Stuff that I'm going to be using. And I have to organize. Except for these things that go into the vault. I bolt these. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. I really like these glitter ones. So if you're watching, I'm gonna use your lashes, girl. After five years, <laughs> no, like 2017, 2018, I've had these. And uh, we use a pair. And then she's like, "Here, I have these." I was like, "Oh, these are cute." She's like, "I already used a pair." And I was like, "Okay, let's use these ones." I think we use Pixie. And yeah, and I don't know why, I don't know how, but I have 
the this and then i have a makeup brush from somebody else i don't know what happened to that it's probably in this drawer or somewhere else but yeah and some makeup bolt so let's start with the modern renaissance palette okay let's see if you could see this drawer now sorry if my floor is a little dirty bring it down more okay just hide the little craziness over here okay Oh my god, what is, I can slide these out. What is that? This. Oh. It's black clothes. Dish dish. No, black black clothes detergent. Why can't I talk? Okay, so this brush is really good. You see what I'm seeing? It's just really crazy leaf full of hair. Okay. Okay, that. <laughs> Let me see. Okay, this squarish round brush. For some reason, this helps with like my curly hair, this dent right here. I don't know if it helps more with volume, but um, I feel like this will pull out my curl and smooth the strands better than a full round brush. And I probably have a round brush in here somewhere, which is probably really old. I stole from my mom's salon. Like a really, really, really long time ago. Let's see, I don't use these, so I'm probably gonna give them to like my sister or my niece. Oh, this one's broken. Throw it out. Okay, this is garbage. That is uh, garbage. These are pantyhose. Them over there. Here's a round brush. Touche by Spornet. This is my mom's. Actually, I use both. I do use both. This brush is way too soft. Like, way too soft. There's nothing to even do it. I'm gonna get rid of it because it's just in the way. Oh my gosh, you guys, it keeps like hiccuping. This is like a new me thing. This can go with those headband thingies for like my niece. Put this on. All these came out of here. Oh my gosh, you guys, I have hiccups. These are horrible. They're rubber elastics. Horrible. I'll just use them for like to tie up something this i've never opened my tweezerman nail files this i didn't know if i washed this or not since it's old i'm gonna recycle it but this i always peel this off like i always peel this off and like reveal a empty jar an empty clear jar and then i make a summer um body scrub and i always keep it in here because it's really sturdy glass and i could shake it and i could see how much i'm pouring and then how much sh body scrub is in there compared to the ingredients when they settle and it's just really fun and that's what i like these argo teas for the cherry one and the hibiscus so good i think there's like a carolina honey one too and i'm not sure Oh my gosh. Okay, so garbage. There's some nail stuff. This cuticle eraser box. Okay, I'm just gonna keep it right here. A napkin. Here's some hair product. This is a head cap. Yeah, a bald cap for a wig. That's garbage. This is an attachment. I'm not ready to show you yet, like what type of hair dryer it's for. <laughs> um, also, just want to let you know that my battery is dying. So, 
So straighteners. These are my curling wands. These are the attachments to the curling wands. All these hair bands that I never knew I had. This headband. This bra clasp thing. And this to put like a hair mask or color in. More hair wands. Garbage, garbage. Ooh, these smell so good. These Sebastian dark oil washes. And this is garbage. Garbage. This comb. These are my absolute favorites. I just picked up another one at Sally's. I'm so excited because this one in my drawer, I think it was like that or like that, and it just cracked the tip. And I need it to separate the hair. Some silk, Miracle Silk leave in. More headbands. Woo! My rescue nail oil pen. Oh my gosh, I was looking for this. Yes, I'm so excited, you guys. My nail pusher for Tweezerman. Some, a bunch of duck bill clips. This is for some baby hairs but honestly it doesn't even work so i might as well just like use it as like something else maybe for the wigs or something i don't know there's like a bunch of brushes we already used that i think i'm gonna get rid of all these like rubber bands because like look like what is this you know that's kind of disgusting to me i got a new hair pick i showed you my new hair pick these are the other ones that I used to use. They didn't really do anything. Um, so yeah, they're just good to have though. Uh, duck bill, duck bill. Bunch of hair from the brushes in here. A band, a band. This is another band. A little clip. 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 This is full of hairspray. And I just got some new ones too for my new wigs. This is my cuticle remover. Cuticle nipper. There's some floss. It's actually new, so I'm going to take it with me. Okay, really quick, you guys. Here is my finished little hair drawer. 